Hey everybody, as you well know, a website is the main way to capture leads on the internet. However, very few customers actually make a purchase as soon as they visit your website, especially if the price is more than $10. It's the same with all of us, right? We tend to slow down and research a bit. To deal with it, customers tend to seek answers to their questions before they commit to a purchase, rather than leaving the website straight away. That means the task is to make sure the customer can do just that, ask questions. For that, we need convenient communication tools on the website itself. Ammo CRM is equipped with a special tool for this purpose. It's called CRM Plugin. This plugin combines all the communication channels that have been integrated into your account into a single button that the customer can use to contact you. Together with the CRM, the plugin can help your business interact with customers, namely, receive messages from new potential customers from any channel and immediately transfer them to a responsible user within the system. Write in any chat directly through the CRM without needing to switch apps and also automatically sync messages in the lead profile, giving you a complete history in one place. Sounds pretty cool, doesn't it? Let's take a closer look. The plugin is connected as a source of new leads. It means that all the incoming messages will go directly to the sales pipeline. We're currently in the leads section. Go to the pipeline setup, click add source, choose CRM plugin. CRM plugin is a multi-channel source, meaning the customer can choose the channel they feel comfortable using in order to contact your company. You can add any channel from the list. Let's see, I'd like to add Telegram, WhatsApp, and live chat. It's important to mention one thing about Instagram and Facebook integrations. Only business pages can be connected to third-party software, including Ammo CRM. It is not possible to integrate your personal pages. To integrate Instagram, your Instagram business page must be linked to a Facebook business page. Now, let's try to connect our WhatsApp and Telegram business pages to Ammo CRM. Let's start with WhatsApp. Click Setup. Click Install. Log into WhatsApp by scanning the QR code from my WhatsApp app. And done! Now let's connect Telegram. Click Setup, then click Install. To connect Telegram to Ammo CRM, you will need to create and connect a Telegram bot. And to do that, you'll need to follow these steps. Number one, go to Telegram and find at botfather by using the search bar. Number two, write start and the bot will provide you with a list of available commands. Three, Use the new bot command and follow the given instructions to create a new bot. 4. Botfather will text you when your bot is created. You will get a link to your bot and an API token. 5. Copy this token and enter it in the form below. Now you can arrange the way the buttons are organized. On top of that, you can also edit the button design. Enable animation so that customers will pay more attention to the button. Yeah, I'll take waves for this one. This is what the animation will look like. Choose the size of the button. Big button, small button. Choose the color. There's no shame in looking good. Make it fit your website color scheme. Choose the color of the close button. I'll leave it as it is, white color. Yeah, this is how it will look on the website. And done. Let's customize the button further. First, let's choose the location. The lower right corner will do just fine. Next, do we want it fixed while scrolling or not? Make it sticky. Let it follow customers, just in case. Below, we can edit the border margins. Might come in handy if the button overlaps other buttons on the mobile version of your website, for instance. In this case, let's leave them as is. Here is how the button will expand. Let's choose vertical expansion. To drive chat requests better, we can activate the welcome message. Fill in the message body, edit the key actions. There are also reactions. We can select button animation, the welcome message, pop-up form, or even add a task. The welcome message is configured and we can also edit the bot. Custom header here, add a title and upload an avatar. Looks all right to me. Finally, select the frequency with which the bot will show the welcome message to the customer, once per session. You can also specify additional conditions, time spent on the website, number of pages visited, or a specific URL to show the message only to those users who visit certain pages of your website. We will display a welcome message to all users who have spent more than 30 seconds on the web page. The welcome message is set and ready to go. One of the channels that I added is live chat. 
Here we can title it and upload the profile photo. If you want to display the sender's name, you can turn that on here. And that's it. The plugin setup is complete. Now we need to place the plugin on a web page before we can add the link on the website. Be sure to specify the full format of the link with https colon forward slash forward slash click save. The plugin code has been generated. Now it must be placed in the website's HTML markup. To create a button on your website, you can use any CMS, WordPress, Joomla, Wix, etc. And connect it directly to Amo CRM without any help of a designer or programmer. Here is our website and now I will show you how to put the button there. Copy the code, move it to the website. Each CMS has its own setup. Some of them can require an extra plugin. Just follow the instructions, paste in the code and click save. Now let's check how the page looks like. That's the stuff. We made the button directly in Ammo CRM without any external help. Go team us! Now let's find out how to work with leads that come through the contact button. Let's choose a channel, for example, live chat and send a message. Going back to Ammo CRM, the leads section, in the incoming leads, we can see a new request. Open it. This is what the request looks like. Current stage, incoming leads. Next, we see the client's card and then the message. Let's respond to the client directly from Ammo CRM. In my case, we have a new request, so let's accept it. In the first stage of the pipeline, a new client's lead has been created. Keep in mind that the lead title is the name of the request channel where the message comes from. To prevent the lead from getting lost and to be able to contact the client as soon as possible, I assign the responsible user and send him a message by chat. The responsible user will receive a notification and will be able to immediately process the client and schedule the meeting for discussing the details of the future project. Now we've learned how to add different communication sources to your website and let your customer connect with you better. Besides, we configure the contact button directly in Ammo CRM by ourselves, personalized it and added it to the website. Now it's your turn to create and personalize contact buttons yourself so you can always keep in touch with your clients. Good luck.